In recent years, fuel scarcity has characterized the Yuletide season, making it difficult and expensive for travelers. This year, however, seems different, as there are no signs of queues, particularly in the federal capital territory. Well, I'm excited for one that there's no queue. It takes the stress off you. And I think uh, maybe they just got it right this time, or maybe it's just intervention. But I'm happy that there's no queue in festive season for a long time. The reasons why there is no queue at this time around is that uh, because um, there is still subsidy and the, the fuel is being subsidized and a lot of persons are bringing fuel into the country. And because the government is paying them, then the, the marketers are not going to strike. The group managing director of the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation, NNPC, on a tour of filling stations in the FCT, blames the last fuel crisis in 2017 on the fraudulent activities of marketers. The oil marketing companies uh, were very busy diverting products, hoarding products. Of course, we are aware of some of their collaborators that aided and abetted them to uh, help with the diversion and also hoarding. Here shows of abundance of petrol beyond the Yuletide. In, in late January to early February, we are bringing in about double the daily requirements uh, of the country and we're able to build up stock. Uh, as the moment, we have a 60 days supply uh, in tank, about almost uh, 3 billion liters of uh, PMS. That will last us without bringing any extra drop of fuel another 60 days. While the authorities pat themselves on the back for the availability of petrol this period, Many Nigerians look forward to how a uniform price of the product can be achieved across the country. Terry Ikumi, Channels Television News.